guys well welcome back um, again I'm driving the uh, Jeep around with the, the programmer and super chips uh, it, it, it seems to be still doing good this is the second part of this video um, I like it I mean it's still it's still got that that slow part I mean it it works but I just can't get over the uh, still that overdrive is messing me up. I don't. I don't like it. Uh, definitely off the off the line is a hell of a lot better. Uh, interstate a lot better, but I still got to tweak it. <laughs> so uh, anybody make a comment on maybe they've had the same experience. Mine's a 2011 Sahara. Uh, it does have a throttle body spacer programmer I got I do it dual exhaust that's coming in the video also later um, I just can't just can't put my finger on it. I'm trying to tweak it best I can um, so maybe somebody knows more than me about these programmers uh, I'm thinking about writing them and see what they say it definitely the, the throttle response and, and the overall is a heck of a lot better but like when you hit it, it's all right. It's all right. It's not. It's not gonna break no records or beat no nobody in a race. That's for sure. But I can beat Grandma off the line. <laughs> Grandma will be gone. But that's about it. <laughs> now I'm thinking about putting 33s on it. I see everybody puts 35s. And I, for all y'all that got 35s with an older Jeep. I don't see how y'all drive it because it's slow. I got 31s with a two and a half lift and it, man, shoot, a Honda will beat this thing. Um, so I'm thinking about putting 30, 33s on it, 20, 22 33s uh, to get the look and the stout part. Um, but I don't want 35s because I think they're going to look stupid. Uh, and definitely ain't gonna go nowhere unless you got a, a nine inch lift which if anybody's got a jeep it's so it's like a rocking horse uh, it does ride good uh, and i'm scared if i put anything bigger it's gonna take away that ride i mean it does with the new lift with the springs and the, and the shocks and again i'll, I'll, I'll comment below uh, what lift you got that's better than a rough country. I'm sure there's, for the money, there's there's more, but uh, this one was only 200, 250, maybe 300. Uh, but it came with the shocks and the, the springs. And I tell you, the front was a pain in the butt to put in. But it, it's something that if you got a garage and, and a couple jack stands and the tools, you can get it done. Um, so comment below I would like to know what lift you ride with um, I know the newer Jeeps they're gonna ride a hell of a heck of a lot better but the older Jeeps 2011 and 2014 maybe even 08 how did they ride and what lift did you use um, so subscribe or comment below let me know you subscribe uh, hope y'all have a good day um, more to come I'm gonna try to tweak that programmer let you know what I do, if it gets better, uh, if the throttle response is better uh, with the, the tweaks I do uh, and what I'm running. So thanks for watching. Hope you have a good day. Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. Um, I'm out driving a Jeep. I, uh, first time taking it out with the new programmer. Drive kicks in and 
something about that transmission at the at overdrive it doesn't want to doesn't want to shift right but i hope everybody's having a good day um I'm, i know i'm my other videos is kind of blotchy and stuff and i'm working on that uh, but don't don't lose hope i'm gonna try to tweak it and get it better and uh if you like the videos i've been doing and, and support my channel subscribe below please um it's only going to get bigger um this is just a part-time thing right now just because you know i'm starting out but i would love to do videos once or twice a week more stuff to come different vehicles um so please subscribe below and hopefully we can uh keep this thing going all right welcome back i am uh trying to tune it a little bit and see if it makes it any better all the stuff i've been talking about um i'm at the the tune so turn ignition on press ok so it says um sorry my fan was on quick options running options vehicle settings tire size I have it set to 3150 that's okay oh it wants to that's stupid it wants me to turn it off when it was already programmed so please wait resetting which I don't know it was already set to that but that part's kind of stupid so if super chips you need to fix this clearing DTCs blah 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 sorry about this guys I clicked on a button I shouldn't have so clearing DTCs your codes blah 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 that should do whatever there wasn't no codes anyways but uh, I guess it's got to run its course clearing clearing blah 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 there we go complete as you can see tire size modified which was already 3150 so the gear ratio I this is something that I don't understand because if you didn't change the gears how can it change the gear ratio and maybe I'm, I'm I need to read more into it, but you know, right now it's set to stock. I'm gonna set it to um, 488. You can see there, 488. Click. So I gotta do it again. Um, comment below because maybe somebody else knows more than I do. And again, I ain't done no research on it. You know, I know how to work it, but how can this change the gears? It might not even change the gears. And I just, being being me, just click on the buttons. You know, it starts to work. Um, you know, I, I'm used to tuners with a diesel. I do. I had a, two diesels in my life, and, you know, programmer changed everything, the whole engine. So this new, uh, the gasoline part, you know, I, I bought this thinking that I would make a, a good difference in my Jeep, which I love, don't get me wrong, but it, it, it's a little bit more complicated than uh, my diesel was. You say, give me power, and it's like, boom, instant power. Um, transfer case low, I'm not gonna do that. TPS warning, that's the threshold's down, TPS is off, because I have uh, new tires, but they're, um, the. The sensors I don't think are in them, so I, I can turn that off, which is great. Fog light dropout, what is that? Hey, that's enabled. Updated. One touch chain, yeah, her one chirp. Da -da 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 -da. I'm going to exit. So, don't want to return it to stock. Running options, no engine idle. So, tune. 
I believe I'm running. I believe I'm running um, performance because I only put 93 in this thing. Again, trying to get as much as I can out of this bad boy. Uh, and I am running that. So, as you can see right there, I'm running it already. So, I'm going to exit that. So, that is it. So, we're going to take it now. Let's see what it does. Um, exit. I believe. Turn info. Scan. I don't need to do none of that. So I'm gonna unplug it now and see what this bad boy does. And the only thing I really changed was the gear ratio. So let's see if it changed it like I thought it would. tried this last time and I couldn't tell a difference but uh, comment below so I can know if you know more about this than I do um, again I, I'm a guy so I don't do a lot of research I just buy it do it uh, I do that with all my cars you know unless I have a problem with them and obviously I have a problem now so somebody else knows more than me please comment and uh, let me know below and subscribe try it out I'm gonna keep the overdrive on see if this makes a difference with uh, going in and out I'd run <laughs> run right through this light but I'm not so I would love to be there though you can see my insane design some shout out to uh, his channel I watch him all the time that's why I started actually doing this I watched him from when he was uh, just doing the Bronco and uh, now I'm you know what I'm trying to do it I've had 35 cars in my lifetime and uh, said one day I'm going to do a YouTube channel and why not so far it's nice outside it's cold though here in Virginia um, it's 53 right now but it's sunny nice good day for a drive so I figure I get the Jeep out go to Home Depot um, my main job I do uh, I build houses and remodel been doing it for 22 years so I've always been interested in trucks, cars, anything that goes fast, anything that gets you in trouble. Don't ask me why I got a Jeep, because it's slow. It's a little better. That just could be me saying that because I just put a different tune in it, I guess. But seems to be running good. to see him at another red light sorry guys skip right through <laughs> see what it does here in a minute traffic's moving i'm gonna get on interstate hit it a little bit see if we can get a good feel for what what the programmer did they do make good programmers um i think edge makes a little bit better but super chips is very good uh real reliable uh never any glitches but 
I'm not sure why they put the gear thing in there. I guess if you change gears, uh, it makes a difference, but you can hear that wind in the background. That's my, because I got a, uh, a light across the front and it drags air. Thanks for watching.